what is going on YouTube fam well it's officially day one after I have uh, started micro scrubbing again and uh, I only did about maybe four hours or so just to kind of get the tank uh, reacclimated to the whole process probably do another four hours again tonight and then uh, start uh, gradually bumping it up to letting it do it all night long corals were definitely sliming away and today everything looks plump and happy uh, maybe even a little bit happier than it has been just at, even after that's four hours worth of uh, micro scrubbing I uh, figured I'd go ahead and do kind of the same thing I did last time short little update every day uh, and uh, wanted to shoot some videos since I've got some stuff glued down tank is starting to take some shape looking good All right, well, it's officially been a week that I have started micro scrubbing again, and so far so good. No complaints about anything, and all the corals seem pretty happy about it. Uh, I have not noticed any increase in my alkalinity, which I know has been a topic of discussion uh, surrounding this issue, and so far so good. It's been stable, haven't had any issues, and uh, haven't had to really change any of my dosing. Uh, maybe there's been a little bit more of evaporation, but I haven't been topping off any more to really make a difference with my alkalinity consumption. Or maybe perhaps my corals are absorbing it faster, and with my increased dosing, it's simply just balancing out. I I'm not really sure. But it's only been a week. Everything seems happy. I did pick up a few new pieces. Picked up a emerald green torch and uh, what might be either a pink or gold octospawn. It's back there in the corner. It's a little unhappy. A uh, piece of it looks like it has broken off, so it's a little sad. Uh, I'm a little worried about it. I hope it makes it. I already had to super glue some back, but I did not notice the other part of it that was falling off. Okay, so it's been two weeks of micro scrubbing and the successful results continue. I still have only been scrubbing for maybe six hours a night. I'm still not doing all 12 uh, just because I'm getting so much evaporation uh, during the night I definitely notice a jump in my salinity just over the six hours of micro scrubbing. Other than that though even with the additional evaporation uh, my alkalinity still has not really risen hardly at all. In fact it's been pretty consistent. Corals are all very happy. I'm getting great polyp extension, great color. So far so good. Week two. Alright, finally four weeks of micro scrubbing. And the results have been pretty good. All the corals seem relatively happy. I have not noticed any change in my water chemistry as far as uh, pH or alkalinity. Nothing crazy. I've had a little bit more evaporation, you know, but I only micro scrub maybe six to eight hours a night. So I'm not even really doing the full 12 hours. One thing I will say, it seems like when I'm micro scrubbing as opposed to not micro scrubbing, the corals seem to bounce back quicker uh, from ailments or something stupid that I do. Maybe I bump them, stick my hand in the water too much when my hands are still dirty. Either way, the slime coat that they produce at night, the next day the corals just look amazing. And I've been getting great growth out of everything. Of course I also do 10 gallons a week water changes, 5 gallons like every 2 to 3 days, 3 to 4 days. I don't run a skimmer, uh, so I think the micro scrubbing definitely helps me. Finally after about 2 weeks, my everlasting gobstopper palette, which is kind of hard to see. It's finally opening up. During those two weeks that it was closed, it spit out two new polyps. So that's pretty exciting. Everything has just been doing much better. I think I've been feeding a little too much. I've got some algae on the sand bed. The latest problem I'm having, however, is my anemone. 
he decided to attach to the rock that the Ghani's on. So that's less than ideal. Let's see what he does. I did turn my whites up 5%, so now they're at 10%. So maybe he's reacting to that. We'll see. So there you have it, four weeks of micro scrubbing. Working great for anybody thinking about doing it. Make sure uh, you have enough air pushing through your air stone going into your return pump. So you're getting that nice mist cloud of fine bubbles. And then uh, look for your corals to start sliming up. That's how you know that it's working. Appreciate you guys watching and staying tuned. I'm going to keep micro scrubbing. If anything uh, changes or if I have any issues, you guys will be the first to know.